Hi again, this is Ralph Whitman with uh, Fast and Furious and Whitman's and so forth. Uh, I have a lot of questions asked on a, on a regular basis. What is the difference between carding and hand stripping, plucking type of thing? This is a this is kind of a copy of a, of a classic tool. Uh, you'll notice the V's in the back side of this tool. Um, this is, uh, and you'll notice the V's in the front side of this tool as well. Uh, this is a cutting machine when it comes to cutting hair. Uh, but this is uh, this is probably one of the best carding tools on the market uh, versus any of the pluckers. This is going to obviously one of the best pluckers on the market, and I will show you the difference. This tool being the carding tool, I'm not going to entrap any hair at all. Basically, what we're going to do is we're going to lay this tool flat down on the dog. We're going to grab the hair up here, and we're going to raise this about 20, 25 degrees, and we're just no entrapping of the hair. My thumb's not out here at all. So all we're going to do is we're going to rake. And you can see that it's taking huge amounts of hair this way. This is all undercoat, very, very few top coats. You'll see that it is cutting some coat in there, but be very, very careful that you don't cut the coat and you just do the undercoat. That's what you're after. This is a great carding tool. This tool, if I was to card with it, it does not do a very good job at all. This is not, a, this is not designed to card. This is designed to pluck and plucky it, it does a great job and you'll notice that it does not cut any coat versus something of this nature this is the carding tool this will slice hair very very effectively and which is what you don't want to do when you're when you're maintaining your rough coated dogs